Hello and welcome to our little education video about the different types of cleaning options that we have available for you at Natural Smiles and also the different types of cleanings that help you maintain good gum health. Um, so at Natural Smiles we find that we have a number of categories that patients fall into um, and the most simple category is or well, the first category is where patients have a buildup of tartar and plaque around their teeth and what we're doing for them is basically just removing that with a really simple but really detailed cleaning appointment. Uh, and some people call that a scale and polish, some people call that oral hygiene, uh, prophylaxis, so lots of different names can be given to that. But in essence, what we're doing is we're using a uh, electric scaling machine that squirts water and vibrates and removes the tartar off the surfaces of the teeth we're concentrating on the surfaces above the gum and also uh, a little bit below the gum as well. Once that's done, we then polish the teeth to give you a, a nice fresh sensation uh, and also a relatively smooth surface as well. The second type of uh, patient is one who has a buildup of tartar but also has a lot of staining on their teeth. And most common causes for staining are smoking, uh, tobacco chewing, uh, red wine, tea, coffee stains, and also the four, another one is uh, corsodil mouthwash. Prolonged use of corsodil mouthwash will result in uh, staining of the teeth. So for the patients like this, what we're doing is we are doing this cleaning with the scaling, descaling, and we're polishing with an air polisher. Uh, and there are various different names for this, but in effect, the way I like to describe it is like a mini little jet wash. Uh, that gets in all the little nooks and crannies where stains collect um, in the teeth and on the surfaces of the teeth. And what it really does, it really removes uh, plaque on the teeth um, and stains, but primarily from a health point of view, it removes the surface of the tooth that is not your surface, but it's like a film on the teeth that attract plaque and bacteria. So it gives you a really healthy clean as well. And that's a really good way. So that's, we call that the airflow clean at Natural Smiles. Occasionally we have patients who have a lot of buildup of tartar um, and they have some bone loss associated with that tartar, uh, but they don't have full blown active gum disease. Now with these patients, what we're doing is uh, we need to do a, a more in-depth cleaning, sometimes numbing up certain areas, but we need to go under the gum where the tartar has collected and become stagnant. And that stagnant tartar is not good for your gum health and eventually can lead to bone loss. So for patients like that, we are removing the tartar below the gum. And re usually this requires a couple of appointments, about 30 to 50 minutes long. Each appointment, we're getting really deep detail cleaning and then polishing that surface as well, allowing you to maintain the really good gum health that you can achieve after that. The next category of patients that we have are patients that have quite active gum disease. Uh, and gum disease is a disease that is usually pain-free, uh, usually um, symptom-free of any kind. So sometimes you can have patients that have quite bad gum disease and not know they've got it. Um, and, and that's a problem because you're not going to uh, reach out to a dentist or a dental professional and say, oh, I've got gum disease, because if you don't know you've got it, you don't know you've got it. And, and that's a challenge because what we have to do is educate yourself, uh, educate patients to say, look, this is what we've got, what we can see, and these are the symptoms and the signs of that gum disease. The most common signs of gum disease is bone loss that we can see when we take an x-ray. So we take a full mouth x-ray at your new patient appointment uh, and we would see bone loss generalized or even sometimes localized in certain areas. Now what we're doing for patients of this nature is either it can be really severe and uh, we need to then refer you to a gum specialist or a periodontist, or more often we're able to treat you initially with a gum treatment within the practice. So with that, what we're doing is we are uh, measuring the bone loss around each individual tooth in six different sites. So once we've measured that bone loss, these are called pockets. So we're measuring each pocket per tooth 
in six different locations around each tooth. Once that's done, we then have a really good idea of how much bone loss you have and which areas are really severely damaged. We then uh, numb up the area and we clean the surfaces that are affected, all the surfaces, and we are removing any tartar that's physically present. We are removing tartar below the gum and above the gum using the electric scaling machines that we have. And then what we're doing is we are making sure there aren't any overhanging fillings, overhanging crowns, poorly shaped fillings for various reasons, leaving the surfaces really easy to clean. And then we are using hand scaling techniques to really smooth the surfaces of the, the root under the gum or below the gum, allowing a really good adhesion and, and healing of the gum health. What we then want to do is maintain that by you cleaning your teeth uh, differently and we'll advise you on that and then finally making sure that you're seen by our team on a three monthly basis to make sure that things are maintained really really well and just keeping on top of that so that's the type of clean that patients need or the type of treatment that patients need if they have gum disease. Oral hygiene education is an integral part of dental hygiene treatment and uh, we would provide you with a personalized uh, regime to uh, maintain the health of your gums. Um, and that would be different techniques for brushing, different types of brushing, um, how to clean between the teeth, what to use between the teeth, and also just general uh, care of your teeth with the diet and, and maintaining optimal health when you're at home. Um, and making sure that things last really, really long.